into the city here. Let's try to drive this booger through the city. Why not? Never driven one, so might as well make it interesting, huh? <laughs> What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back or to the channel. If you cannot tell by the scenery, we are somewhere super epic today. We are down here at Cage Trailer Sales here in Arthur, Illinois. First time ever being here and such a blessed. I'm so grateful for this opportunity. Number one, the good Lord above blessing me today to be able to do this for all of you guys. All of you guys for subscribing to the channel, for liking the videos, and to my family who just has this overwhelming love and support for me on this journey and overtime diesel all the guys down there ov has been incredible to us from the jump and that is what we do it for for the whole industry so with that being said we're down at kate's everybody knows gooseneck trailers are the way to go if you're going to be hauling stuff for your diesel content so that's what we're doing here today we are going to pick up a gooseneck trailer brand new 2025 off the lot went with a load trail I know a lot of guys that have preferences on trailers and even sponsorships. You know, you got Gabe and Blake who rock with Doolittle. You got Greg A that rocks with PJ. You have people like myself. I'm a little bit on the cheaper side of things, but still love the quality. And everything's comparable nowadays, but Low Trail, I've seen Lacey Blair. I've seen CJ Crew Diesel with Low Trail stuff and Super Epic. So I'm going with a Low Trail. That's the one I wanted. I see them all around town. And and I was looking at used prices and everything that was used was really only a couple thousand dollars cheaper than a brand new one so we are going brand new today and i'm just pumped i got jitters it was a long drive i was up super early to make this happen but we are down here looking at the cool stuff and gonna get inside i called ahead got all the paperwork ready my man marcus hooked me up dude is incredible down here hit him up honestly everybody from the minute i walked in the door i felt like i was at home so a little blurb for them even though they're not sponsoring this video shout out to kate's and check this out guys right here they got everything. We're not buying this cool green one, but CJ's is orange. This green one is freaking crazy. I'm gonna hop up here. Just, just window shopping, look. Deck beds as far as the eye can see. Look at them. They do like 600 trailers on the lot at one time so they got everything down here guys major major deal actually um i was told that whistling diesel bought his load trail from here as well cody came down here and got his gooseneck that pulled the hilux i'm gonna have to go back and watch that video and see it because i barely remember that video at all but yeah it's a it's a real deal this place is real so i'm just pumped i'm having a great time a little bit tired but they got everything i see dump trailers there's dump trailers, there's enclosed trailers, there's big ones, there's small ones, and I'm kind of meeting right in the middle with a 26. So I think it's going to be absolutely perfect for what I need it for, which is nothing other than putting toys on it. So not doing this for work, not trying to get a job, don't hire me. Just going to have it on the channel for hauling things back and forth to overtime, to OV shop, back home, to friends and family, and hopefully help some people out. I also want to be able to throw the tractor on there, throw some tools on there whatever and go help some people out because this world is all about helping each other so just like i said just overwhelmed with emotions right now and excited as can be so we're going to show you the trailer get inside get things wrapped up and yeah here we go guys Video of it here in the shop. You guys want to be on YouTube? <laughs> oh my 
But you can see, got a PJ over there on the nice flatbed. You can see the trucks in here. Heck of a unit down here at Kate's. They got us hooked up, guys. 26 foot gooseneck here, flatbed, buggy style with the drive over ramps. We'll get it outside and get out of these guys' hair, but I just want to show you guys here in the shop. Pretty sweet. Got all the paperwork done in the doors there. The guy Marcus hooked us up, and then we come out here, fine gentleman, got us hooked up set the bed got all the lights made sure everything worked before we hit the road so a big shout out to those guys for getting us hooked up but let's get this sucker pulled out in the sun in the daylight so you guys can see it more and we'll go over it but yeah i just wanted to show you guys here we go all right guys so here it is sitting right out in front of kate's it looks so good behind the daily and it's so cool to actually be towing with this truck for a reason so check out the brand new 2025 load trail you can see this booger down here at kts absolutely awesome got it all hooked up you guys if you didn't see the last video where i put the bmw hitch in that thing hooked up flawlessly like i said the guys hooked me up getting everything set just right running the cable making sure we got power to all the lights but look at this booger it just sits so beautifully on the ground and the buggy style looks so good because i like that it sits lower to the ground instead of the deck overs i know everybody has their own personal preference on that but for me this is what i like this looks so killer 26 foot I'm actually really happy that I went with 26 instead of 20 to have the extra room and it just looks so massive. The flip down ramps are up for debate. I kind of like the ones that folded all the way over. I asked if we could get, you know, the other ones put on here. He said no, the way these are attached specifically for this. Um, so we're going to leave them. They look cool. That way if something rolls back, maybe it'll catch them. I don't know. But guys, just take a look around. This is a real, real trailer. Not them bumper pulls. No disrespect. This is just epic. See on here, look at all the room we got for activities. Easily get two, maybe even three razors on here. You know we're going to have to try it out. And it comes with a full-size spare up there. Look at that. Beautiful. And then on the back here, you can run a hit a winch anywhere on here, I was being told. And then maybe put like a wet box for a battery. I want to also put one of those work lights on this rail here. A big LED strip so it can shine on the back. So if you guys know of any on Amazon or etc. Or want to sponsor one, send it my way. That would be awesome. But you guys can see, sorry, I act like I own the place. I pulled right up here. <laughs> but anyways, guys, check it out. Check out the deck boards. Everything looks super nice free little corn stock there how about you but yeah drive over ramps we're gonna see how the race truck does on here um and yeah we're gonna see what all goodies we can put on the trailer what do you guys want to see first um so yeah you can see all the industrial style lighting everything looks cool i wonder maybe i should go in there and turn it on for you guys here bear with me i'm just out here cruising having an absolute riot this thing looks epic guys let's see if we can turn on the lights there they go now you can see with the boost auto running lights how sick it's gonna look it just rained it hasn't rained check out the jays they're all the filthy but anyways it hasn't rained in months guys and of course the one day i come down here it's raining but you can see the lights there's the amber ones mixed in with red. I don't know what all they mean. I'm sure they mean certain things for DOT for legal reasons, but I love the big square ones in the back. Absolutely sick LED ones, so you know they're going to last. But yeah, what do you guys think? You guys into trailers? Man. We'll get this sucker back home, probably get it over to Ovi's and see if we can put some goodies on here in the next one. Because right now I just want to hit the road and get home. This is about several hour drive. Just got up at the crack of dawn. But anyways, look at it go. I keep saying it, just look at it because that's all you need to do. But yeah, shout out to KTS, man. The guys are awesome. Well, looky there, a blacked out Freightliner trying to show me up. Can't really speak to that. That thing looks incredible, but so does my setup. I'm very grateful, very blessed to be here today, guys. And I just keep saying it, but what do you guys think? Is this not the coolest deal yet? I mean, dang, I got somebody pull up, so I'm trying not to get run over. But yeah, there's the setup. Super, super crazy the way it all looks. 
All right, guys, so like I said, I am loaded up and ready to hit the road to get this sucker back home and have some fun, show it off a little bit, and just get there before the weekend starts, et cetera, et cetera. Again, I feel like I'm just gonna smile the entire drive. We'll see how it goes. I've never even driven a gooseneck trailer. That's how embarrassed I am to say it, but that's okay, dumb bumper pulls. Just gonna swing it a little bit wide and see how she does. I got several hours to get used to it, right, on the way home. No way to just go and dive right into it. That's the best way right or the worst way we're about to find out but let's get on the road and if you don't hear anything from me and this video ends that's because it went smooth if not i'll show you something dumb from the way home um yes god bless you all thank you we'll see y'all in the next one okay peace oh yeah on the maiden voyage ladies and gentlemen she is back there just a towing right along <laughs> I'm having fun, I'm just on the back roads. I've been driving for like three minutes, but it's a lot better than I thought. You can feel it back there, but it is towing like a dream. It really just turns and pulls just fine, honestly. And obviously there's no weight on it yet, so we can address it then, but for now, super cool. I'm having a blast. Sun's coming up, it's just all smiles, baby. How's it towing, Joe? Oh, it's towing, ladies and gentlemen. It is towing. You can definitely feel it back there, but it is not bad at all. Following every move I make, and I am just smiling from ear to ear. I keep looking back at it, look back at it, and it's super sick. Um, one thing I did not account for was the fuel. I am getting way worse fuel economy now, uh, but that is okay because it is miles per gallon. I haven't even looked at any gauges or done any math. It's just worse. Um, so burning a lot more fuel on the way home than on the way there but i'm sure that is expected with a big heavy trailer but nonetheless um having just an absolute riot guys thought i'd let you know that okay goodbye